Hello, my name is Riata Scott, and in this bonus video to our InDesign CS6 Creating a Newsletter from Scratch series, we're going to very briefly talk about grouping objects. Here we have a banner ad, and if we want to move or resize it, we'll have to shift-click each item and then do whatever it is we want to do. Then if we decide later that we want to alter it again, we'll once again have to shift-click everything. Or we can group the items. So let's click the first one with our selection tool. Hold down shift, click the cloud, the goose, the text, and the background. And then we can right click and choose group or control G if you group a lot. That's easy to remember. Group. Now notice that everything's grouped together. You can tell by this dotted line bounding box around it. And so we can shift the whole thing or we can resize it. Remember when you resize it you want to hold down control and shift at the same time. Pull it out. And let's say though that we've done this and you realize that you need to make the goose a little bigger. That's easy. We'll just double click the goose. Again we'll control shift because we want to change the size on that. Make him a little bigger. Move him wherever we want. And then we'll click out and when we click back in, notice that everything's still grouped. Now, if at any time you decide you don't want things grouped anymore, that's very simple to change. Right click, and now we have ungroup instead of group or shift control G. I'm going to leave it grouped though because I want it grouped. Before I end this video, I'd like to mention that IT Training offers free beginning and advanced courses in InDesign as well as other software for all students and staff. So if you're interested in learning more, log into training.missouri.edu today and register for a class.